Welcome, Wanderlust Warriors, to Quarry Kingston Travel, where we turn your travel dreams into a reality. We are your passport to the unseen corners of the world, the untold tales of cultures far and wide, and the unparalleled thrill of a journey well undertaken. Here, we paint the world not just in the colors of its landscapes, but also in the flavors of its cuisines, the rhythms of its music, and the warmth of its people. In every episode, we guide you through the winding alleyways of the world's most captivating destinations. We share insider tips and tricks, deep dive into local cultures, and highlight the must-see sights that make each place unique. We believe in travel that's more than just ticking off a checklist. It's about immersing yourself in the experience, the adventure, the story. Today, we're navigating the sun-soaked coasts and volcanic vistas of the Canary Islands. Ready to embark on this exciting adventure? Before we dive into our top 10 things to do, let's delve into the rich history of the Canary Islands. These islands, a Spanish archipelago off the coast of northwestern Africa, are steeped in a fascinating past. The original inhabitants of the Canary Islands were the Guanches, an aboriginal people of mysterious origins. They lived in caves and simple huts, farmed the land, and created intricate pottery and sculptures. In the late 15th century, the Spanish conquest began, led by explorers like Juan Rajon and Alonso Fernandez de Lugo. The Guanches put up a fierce resistance, but by the end of the century, the islands were firmly under Spanish control. The Canary Islands have played a key role in maritime history. Christopher Columbus stopped in Gran Canaria and La Gomera during his famous voyage to the New World in 1492. The islands served as a crucial stopover point for ships traveling to the Americas, providing fresh water, food, and repairs. In the centuries that followed, the Canary Islands continued to be a melting pot of cultures, with influences from Africa, Europe, and the Americas. This rich tapestry of multicultural influences has shaped the island's unique culture, music, food, and nightlife. Now that we've immersed ourselves in the past, it's time to explore the present. Starting our countdown at number 10, we're taking a hike, literally. Picture yourself embarking on an adventure trek through the breathtaking landscapes of the Canary Islands. With each step, your senses come alive as you immerse yourself in the remarkable beauty of these unique islands. From the lush, green forests of Garahunay National Park in La Gomera to the lunar-like landscapes of Mount Teide in Tenerife, each island offers a unique hiking experience. As you navigate through these diverse terrains, you'll encounter a rich variety of flora and fauna, some of which can only be found in this part of the world. And oh, the views. Imagine standing atop a mountain peak looking out over a panorama of azure seas, rugged cliffs, and rolling hills covered in a patchwork of vibrant colors. It's a sight that will take your breath away, and one you'll want to capture in your memory forever. But it's not just about the sights. As you hike, you'll hear the melodic songs of native birds, the rustling of leaves in the breeze, and the gentle crashing of waves in the distance. It's a symphony of sounds that will soothe your soul and make you feel at one with nature. And let's not forget about the scents. The air in the Canary Islands is filled with the sweet fragrance of blooming flowers, the earthy aroma of the forest floor, and the salty tang of the sea. It's a sensory experience that will awaken your senses and leave you feeling invigorated. Now hiking in the Canary Islands isn't just a walk in the park. It can be challenging with steep ascents, rocky paths, and sometimes unpredictable weather. But don't worry. It's an adventure suitable for all fitness levels, and there are plenty of guided tours available to ensure you have a safe and enjoyable experience. So lace up your hiking boots, pack your sense of adventure, and prepare to explore the Canary Islands like never before. After an exhilarating hike, it's time to unwind. At number nine, we're diving into the crystal clear waters of the Canary Islands. The waters here are not just an idyllic turquoise playground. They're a world of adventure, teeming with a plethora of water sports that cater to every kind of thrill seeker. Surfing, for instance, is an absolute must try. The Canary Islands are often referred to as the Hawaii of Europe, thanks to their consistent year round waves, making it a paradise for surfers. Whether you're a seasoned pro or a complete beginner, there's a wave here with your name on it. But the aquatic fun doesn't stop at the shoreline. Beneath the surface, a whole new world awaits. 
Snorkeling is another popular pastime, offering a chance to discover the island's vibrant marine life up close. From playful dolphins to elegant manta rays, the waters surrounding the Canary Islands are a living, breathing testament to nature's wonder. For those who prefer a more laid-back water experience, sailing around the islands is the perfect choice. Feel the wind in your hair and the sun on your skin as you navigate the azure waters. Whether you charter a yacht for a day or embark on a sunset cruise, you'll find that the Canary Islands from the water are a sight to behold. And let's not forget about the adrenaline-pumping jet skiing, the tranquil paddleboarding, and the adventurous deep-sea fishing. The Canary Islands offer a smorgasbord of water sports that will leave you both physically exhilarated and mentally refreshed. But the adventure doesn't end when you step out of the water. The Canary Islands are as much about the journey as they are about the destination. They're about the thrill of the unknown, the excitement of the new, and the joy of discovery. After a day in the water, it's time to explore the local flavors. The Canary Islands are a gastronomic delight, offering a blend of traditional Spanish cuisine with a unique island twist. But that's a story for another scene. For now, let's dry off and get ready for the next adventure. Moving to number eight, we're tantalizing our taste buds with Canarian cuisine. The Canary Islands, an archipelago off the coast of Africa, offers a unique culinary experience that blends Spanish, African, and Latin American flavors. First up, we have the papas arrugadas, or wrinkled potatoes. These are small salty potatoes served with mojo, a spicy sauce made from garlic, paprika, and other spices. But it's not just about the potatoes. The Canarian cuisine is a seafood lover's paradise. Freshly caught fish grilled to perfection is a staple of the island. Let's not forget about the Almo Grote, a spicy cheese paste that's a local favorite. Made with hard cheese, garlic, pepper, and olive oil, it's often spread on bread and served as a starter. A bite of this and you'll understand why it's a dish that locals hold close to their hearts. And for those with a sweet tooth, the Bien Mesabe is a must try. This almond cream dessert is a perfect blend of sweet and nutty flavors, often served with ice cream or custard. It's a delightful end to any meal. But of course, it's not just about the food. The Canary Islands also boast an impressive selection of wines. From the full-bodied reds of the La Palma region to the crisp whites of Lanzarote, there's a bottle to suit every palate. And for the more adventurous, why not try the Ron Miel? This honey rum is a traditional Canarian drink often served as a digestive after meals. It's sweet, warming, and the perfect end to a day of adventure. The beauty of Canarian cuisine lies not just in the flavors, but in the way it's enjoyed. Meals are often long, leisurely affairs, enjoyed with friends and family under the warm Canarian sun. It's a culinary experience that's as much about the food as it is about the people you share it with. With our bellies full, let's set off to our next adventure. For number seven, we're immersing ourselves in the vibrant nightlife. When the sun sets, the Canary Islands come alive in a whole different way. The nightlife here is as diverse as the islands themselves. From bustling bars and energetic clubs to laid back beach parties, there's something for everyone. Let's start our nocturnal adventure in the capital city of Las Palmas, Gran Canaria. The city is known for its eclectic mix of entertainment spots, offering everything from flamenco shows to live music venues. The range of options is impressive. Whether you're into jazz, rock, or electronic music, you're sure to find a place that hits the right note. If you're more of a cocktail connoisseur, then the island of Tenerife should be your next stop. The island's sophisticated bars offer an array of locally sourced concoctions that will tantalize your taste buds. Whether you prefer a classic mojito or you're adventurous enough to try a volcano, a fiery cocktail inspired by the island's volcanic landscapes, Tenerife's mixologists have got you covered. But the Canary Islands nightlife isn't just confined to the cities. Imagine dancing barefoot on the sand under a sky full of stars with the waves providing the perfect backdrop. Beach parties are a staple here, especially during the summer. From Fuerteventura to La Palma, each island has its own unique take on this beloved tradition. And if you're seeking a more relaxed vibe, why not spend the evening at a local wine bar? The Canaries are known for their distinctive wines, 
and there's no better way to understand the local culture than by sipping on a glass of Malvasia or Lista Negro while engaging in conversation with the friendly locals. After a night of fun, it's time to take a step back and appreciate the natural beauty. The Canary Islands offer not just a feast for the senses, but also a chance to connect with the world around you. As you watch the sunrise after a night of revelry, you'll understand why this archipelago is a paradise like no other. Number six on our list takes us to the breathtaking national parks of the Canary Islands. These unique landscapes are home to a dazzling array of flora and fauna, which you won't find anywhere else in the world. They're a testament to nature's sheer diversity and resilience. Let's start with the crown jewel of the Canaries, Tayde National Park. Located on Tenerife, the largest of the Canary Islands, this park is named after Mount Tayde, the tallest peak in Spain. The park's lunar-like landscapes, dotted with endemic species like the Tayde violet, are a sight to behold. Next, let's journey to Caldera de Taburiente National Park on La Palma. This park is a geological wonderland, with its massive crater, waterfalls, and dense pine forests. The Canary Island pine trees here have adapted to survive forest fires, symbolizing endurance in the face of adversity. We can't forget about Garahonai National Park on La Gomera, renowned for its ancient laurel forest. The misty, moss-covered trees evoke a sense of stepping back in time. The park is named after the tragic love story of Gara and Jone, making it a place of romance and folklore. Finally, there's Timanfaya National Park on Lanzarote, a stark reminder of the island's volcanic origins. The dramatic landscapes here, shaped by eruptions in the 18th century, are a humbling reminder of nature's power. But the magic of the Canary Islands, National Parks isn't just about the landscapes, it's also about the wildlife. From the bold Canarian lizards to the elusive laurel pigeon, these parks are teeming with creatures great and small. Not to mention they're a birdwatcher's paradise, with species like the blue chaffinch and the Canary Islands stone chat calling these parks home. As we leave the natural world behind, we delve into the world of art and culture. But remember, the Canary Islands, national parks are more than just tourist attractions. They're living, breathing ecosystems that need our respect and protection. So tread lightly, leave no trace, and let the magic of nature sweep you off your feet. Coming in at number five, we're exploring the rich art and culture of the Canary Islands. If you're an art enthusiast, the Canary Islands will not disappoint you. The islands are home to a plethora of museums and art galleries that offer a deep dive into the island's cultural heritage. Among these, the CAME, Atlantic Center of Modern Art in Gran Canaria, stands out for its impressive collection of contemporary art from the Canary Islands, Africa, America, and Europe. For those who are more historically inclined, the Museum of Nature and Man in Tenerife is a must visit. Here you can get a glimpse of the pre-Hispanic Canary Islands with exhibits showcasing archeological finds, ethnographic collections, and paleontological remains. But the cultural experience in the Canary Islands goes beyond museums and galleries. The islands are also known for their vibrant music scene. Throughout the year, you'll find a series of music festivals celebrating various genres, from traditional Canarian folk music to jazz, rock, and electronica. The renowned Canarias Jazz and Mas Heineken Festival, for instance, brings together national and international artists for a grand celebration of jazz music. And let's not forget about Canarian cuisine. The Canary Islands offer a unique gastronomy experience, blending influences from Spain, Africa, and the Americas. From the hearty papas arrugadas served with mojo sauce to the sweet bien masabe, a dessert made with almonds, honey, sugar, and egg yolk, the island's culinary scene is as diverse as it is delicious. In the evening, the islands come alive with an exhilarating nightlife. Whether you're looking for a laid-back beach bar, a lively pub, or a swanky nightclub, you'll find it all in the Canary Islands. And of course, don't miss out on the opportunity to join a traditional Canarian party, or Romeria, where locals dress in traditional costumes, sing, dance, and feast. With a rich understanding of Canarian culture, we arrive at our top four adventures. Now, for the final reveal, the top four adventures await in our next episode. We've journeyed through the vibrant culture, history, and nightlife of the Canary Islands, but there's still more to uncover. Picture this, you're plunging into the unknown, 
conquering the highest peaks, immersing in the local culture, and savoring the true essence of Canarian cuisine. But we're just scratching the surface here. The ultimate Canary Islands adventure is yet to come. Stay tuned for the ultimate Canary Islands adventure. That concludes our journey through the Canary Islands for now. What an adventure we've had, huh? We've traversed the sweeping dunes, explored the vibrant markets, and tasted the flavors of this island paradise. From the rich history to the pulse-pounding nightlife, the Canary Islands have so much to offer. And the best part, this is just the beginning. In our next episode, we're going to take you further into the heart of the Canary Islands. We'll dive into the crystal clear waters, hike the majestic mountains, and discover hidden gems that only the locals know about. So pack your bags and buckle up. The adventure is just getting started. And remember, every journey begins with a single step. Your support helps us take that step. Every like, every subscription, every share, and yes, every dollar donated paves the way for more thrilling content. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share our video. Every dollar donated helps us to continue bringing you exciting content. Until next time, keep exploring.